And this is how we spend our nine year anniversary. Today, Jesse and I are celebrating nine years of marriage. I've been with her way longer than that. We actually started dating at 15 years old. We are actually around 17 years or so of being together. We are going to take the kiddos with us to the Fayetteville, Arkansas area, and we're gonna go hiking. Morning didn't start off all that great. The kiddos, well, neither one of them slept at all last night. So they're not in the best of moods, but hopefully they're gonna get a little bit of sleep on the way there and we'll have a good time. So mom, how is this anniversary different from one say we might've had seven or eight years ago? <laughs> so Asha, are you gonna enjoy our anniversary today? Yeah, what are we gonna do? Go on the hike. Oh, okay, yay! And Kyla, are you enjoying yourself? Where are we actually headed, Mama? Crystal Bridges in Bentonville, Arkansas. It's gonna be so romantic. <laughs> Not really. Oh, we're on a ride. Look at all the people. This structure is so awesome. I even got them to hang this heart just for Jesse, being it's our anniversary today. Well, we made it. And we're all in one piece. <laughs> Those are in a little bit better mood than they were earlier. Ash, are you excited? Well, I don't know elevators. Yeah. He likes the elevators. Say hello, Calvo. Hello. Are you having fun so far? Ooh, I'm going to go under the elevator. <laughs> I'm going under the elevator. Okay, if you want to, I guess we can. All right, one last elevator ride for Asher. This is his favorite part so far. What do you think, Asher? Whoa. Wow. Look at this. Look at this crystal. This crystal is called the Holy Grail. Wow. That thing's taller than you. All right, heading outdoors. This is a beautiful trail, isn't it? Wow. Got pretty water right there. Asher, look at that thing. Look at that. A huge spider. Oh my goodness. Is this thing alive? Come here. Whoa. Wait, it's gonna have babies. You better watch it. Oh my goodness. Look at them babies coming out. Ah! Wow. That was a huge spider. All metal. Wow. That's impressive. Whoa, dude. How do you like this bridge? I think we should build one across our creek. <laughs> yeah. What is that? Hey, what noise does a pig make? Always have a backup plan when you're going on an outing with your kids. We brought our stroller and the carrier. I was hoping that he would enjoy the stroller on the hike so that I didn't have to have him strapped to my chest when it's 90 degrees out here, but he wanted the carrier and that's what he's getting. So now me and him are walking all the way the heck back to the car to put a stroller up while mommy and Asher go up front. <laughs> well, this one's gonna be cool when they finish it. Well, we found mommy and Asher. Getting kind of toasty out here. Our original plan was to be here for right around 9.30, 10 o'clock in the morning. So it still felt good. We we're gonna do the outside trail and then go hang out in the building. There's tons of stuff inside to do as well. But because of both of the kids not feeling too good this morning, plans changed. What are all those balls? Isn't that awesome? Look at all those fish. You see y'all?
kicking off the shoes and she's getting in. Oh my goodness. Oh, she say, so stop being rude. Talk to me. Beautiful floral picture. Move up close. This is what it's made of. Wow. Is that cool? It's really cool. What is it? Take a picture of this. <laughs> wow, it's bright out here. What is that? Is that a raccoon? What are we going to do? It says come in and make things. <gasps> I'm going to get you a color. You want to get a color? Okay, what do you want to draw? I'm going to what you find? So my wood is here. This is for you to play with. Look. Look. What is that? A, a little baby, baby raccoon? Little Take baby. him back to his mama. Here you go, mom. There you go. <laughs> Callum, what do you think about this room? Oh, I don't think we're supposed to turn that on. It's supposed to be a bunny. Is that a is that a man? Are those dinosaur bones? That's a jaw. Is that teeth? more of a clubby like mm, 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 mm. <laughs> Walking around this beautiful art museum and what my son repeatedly asked for over and over. Where's an elevator we can go on? Do you know why? Because he lied to mom. Oh, so you don't lie or you'll get a really long, funny nose. Right now your nose is cute because you don't lie that much, but he lied a lot. Can you try this on? I think you'd look, I think you'd look good in there. We're gonna head and go get us some food. You excited for some food, Asher? Yeah. yeah. Another drink. Another drink. Another drink. It's hot outside. Sure, are we out on our romantic anniversary dinner? <laughs> yeah, we are sitting outside because there are construction vehicles over there. It's so romantic. What do you think, Callum? You like it out here?
You say holy Spanish mackerel. Can you say that? <laughs> well, our anniversary date is not quite over, but it's over for the video's <laughs> sake. And how we ended it is we got home, went and checked on the sheep, found another lamb out there. Yeah, Cody so chased the lamb. <laughs> we're up to 14. I have one other one, so this will be the second one that I have to actually bottle feed. She's actually sitting right over here in the mule because I'm going to take her inside tonight. I went out there and I found her laying all by herself, just like I did our previous ewe that I'm bottle feeding right now. So whenever they do not yet have the strength or the herd instincts to stay with the rest of the flock, I bring them inside and I will be bottle feeding them where they get back to strength and then reincorporate them back into the flock like I did my other one. So after our lamb chasing fiasco, I came over to the garden and I've got Asher playing in his little sand pit. And I went in to our strawberry patch and started picking some strawberries and filled up a little bucket for us to munch on later on. Mama is inside washing Callum and putting him down for the evening. In another 20 minutes or so, I'll go inside and get Asher all bathed up and put him down for the night. And then me and Mama can finally have a little bit of alone time for the day. Special occasion dates, once you have kids, aren't always what they used to be, but you can figure out a way to make it fun for the kids and fun for you. And then after the kids go down for the night, mama and daddy can have a little bit of time together finally and enjoy their anniversary together. Hope you guys had a good time hanging out with us. God bless y'all. We will see you on the next one.